get boring and uh, we always love coming into New Orleans. Our fans love coming here. You know, this is the destination city for holidays and a city that knows how to put on big events. You don't get much better. You've been practicing at 10 a.m. to kind of acclimate yourself to that start? You know, we have. We have, and I, and I think it's been good. You know, it, it is a little bit of an early start, but, you know, I sort of prefer it rather than the 8 o'clock start because last year I didn't get to leave the Dome to about 2 a.m. So, uh, but, you know, our kids will hopefully be ready. We've had a really good two weeks of practice. Well, will the fans be ready? I mean, that's an early start time, and a lot of people driving in, it's, a, it's tough to get up that early in Lafayette. You know, I, I think we will. You know, we've brought some great crowds, especially last year, our biggest crowd. And, you know, we had 55,000 at the game. I expect this to turn out again, and I know our fans are going to be here. I think we'll have a, quite a few here for the week, and I think a lot will get up and make the trip down the day of the game. What are the keys to the game to beat Nevada? And what, what, what do you know about this team? Well, first of all, they got a great quarterback, and uh, Fajardo. And uh, he's, I think, second in the NCAA history of most total yards offensively. He, he makes them go. And so, you know, I don't know if you actually stop a great quarterback. You just sort of hope to contain him and slow him down a little bit. He's very talented. Their defense has got a great front four. It'll be a great challenge. If you look at their schedule this year, uh, they, they played really played a tough schedule and uh, gave a lot of teams a really good run. Arizona only beat them by seven. So they're, they're an outstanding football team.